on this elevator parts project, we're taking a look at this armor call button. Let's go ahead and get started. So these buttons were found on armor elevators and these are the kind of older black buttons. I have only personally seen these in the field a couple times and that was in the Washington DC area. However, I'm sure there's plenty more of these around. Now this particular fixture is just an intermediate call button. So there's an up and a down button and then there are these arrows. This fixture is complete as well. So it does have the back box, which is pretty nice. And the overall condition of it is very good. There are a few scratches on the plate, but nothing too bad, nothing too noticeable. I'd say the worst thing is just this little guy right here, but other than that, it's in pretty good shape. So now let's open this thing up and take a look at it on the inside. And this is actually gonna be the first time I've ever seen inside a fixture with these buttons. So I'm really curious to see what they look like. So one thing to note is these buttons are back mounted. So the plate itself does not have the buttons connected to them. They're connected to the box. So taking a closer look at the plate, there's not really a whole lot to see. There are these little metal rings which keep the light only on the specific part. So in this case, the arrows. So again, this is the very first time I've seen inside of these. So I am quite intrigued by these. I've never seen these before. So from the looks of things, the first thing I come to note here is this lamp. So this here is an MB type bulb. So I'm not sure the voltage of this. There's only one of them. So I will be replacing this with two of the same bulbs, but I'm gonna see what voltage this one is. So just looking down inside there, it looks like these were kind of like any other kind of older style fixture. It's a lot of wires here. So let's pull these out just so we can get a better look inside. So now with the wires out of the way, we can see how these work. So there are terminals on either side of the button and it kind of looks like these two are connected together as sort of a common but when you push the button down you'll see this metal piece down here gets pushed against there and it completes the circuit there could be a common with two switches here there could be a switch across this so there's actually a couple different ways that this could be hooked up but i'm just going to go with, with the way they have it so this is the common so these are connected together and when you push the button down it pushes the metal between these two parts and completes the circuit. This other side is the same as well. You see how that works there. So this is this is a rather simple fixture and this isn't gonna be very hard to wire up. This is just gonna follow just a standard intermediate style call station wiring. So I'm gonna take all these wires out as I normally do. Probably will end up reusing some of these and then get this thing set up and lighting up. And now this fixture is finished. These are nice and simple to wire up. They're not too complicated. And you can see here when I push them in, they light up. And turning the light off, you can see it even better. And this looks really nice. So that was wiring these older armor elevator buttons. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.